shows up in town. They love them some Tigers here in Willsborn. Oh, wait a minute, though. Lindale comes in there, another good 3A football team. It's Lindale and Wills Point, and both of these teams had the makings for a great 3A rivalry for years to come. So it's Lindale, and it's Wills Point, and it's big enough to be our... DQ Big Game of the Week! DQ Big Game of the Eagles with a rich tradition of winning. How can you tell? Just walk down the halls. But the neat thing is they don't just celebrate wins only in sports, like softball, but also in Spanish, solo ensemble, science, service school clubs, you name it, Lindale has it and they do it well. Academic state champs three years in a row. In fact, country star Miranda Lambert, a former Eagle. Here, I'll sing one of her songs. <coughs> ah, voice is a little scratchy. Otherwise, you know. But Wills Point is building champions as well. Tigers, 65 state single A champs, now in 3A. WP also with plenty to crow about. Great basketball team plays at a state of the art gym, and their band has been state champs multiple times. Tigers, 9 and 1 last year, and ready to get jiggy with it again this year. Fans would flip for back-to-back postseasons. This is the Tiger Nation! Well, check out downtown Wills Point. This red brick here was laid in 1920. Not only still in use, this is Main Street. Also, the building's still in use. This one, over 100 years old. But Ken Autry Davis Field is brand spanking new. Here they say only the strong survive. They better decimated by injuries this year so far, and a handful of kids out with mono. Lindale, meanwhile, big, bad, and ready, led by big number 77, Sam Schomp, 6'4", 295, and just a junior. The 46 of us out there together, believing in each other, putting everything in like we did last night. Everything's in, and we're going out there, we're going to kick their tail. We're going to K-Wack on their tail. We gotta, we gotta mean it. When we walk out this door, you have your helmet on. You be ready to walk down there to that battlefield, and we go to battle together. What's up? What's up? Brother? Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! First half, each team punts, and then Lindale goes upstairs. Clay Price to Chris Terry, 32 yards and into the zone. Seven zip visiting Lindale Eagles. In fact, next possession, same hookup. Price, the fade to the 6'4", Terry, 24 yards, 15-0 with a two-point conversion. Then, trouble, little 5'5", 130-pound Jaquavian Maxi with it, fumble! Eagles recover, turns into a Josiah Johnson TD. Then, another WP punt, and this, Price, up the gut and gone. 66 yards, 28-0, Lindell Eagles, wow. <laughs> Then after Johnson has a punt return for a touchdown called back, he scores again anyway. A little bit later, the 35-yard catch and run, 35 to nothing, Lindale Eagles blowing them out. Wills Point, in fact, just 80 total yards in the first half with three turnovers and not a single point. Well, at least the bands were good. Second half, the first step to a great comeback is getting one back. Tigers get it here. Trent Jurica to Evan Padilla, 62 yards. Not a score, but it sets one up, 35-7. But Lindale answers right back, and then this. John Reisman, nice run, going in, but fumbles! But the sophomore Johnson is Josiah on the spot, recovers in the end zone, touchdown, ball game. 56-7 is your final. The Eagles soar. They came out here and played as a team. The way we've been, we talked about it. We, we had a meeting last night and really came together as a team. Um, I was just really impressed. Last year they beat us pretty bad, 
Real, well, really bad. <laughs> And we came, we went in there, we got fired up, we came out ready to play, and offensive line executed, defense executed, special teams executed, everybody executed on the team, and we played as a unit, and it helped us a lot. We came out on fire, knew we were going to win, we um, executed very well, started off well, and kept going. We knew they were tough because they beat us last year real bad, and we had to get them back. That was, that was like the main main thing, we had to get them back. Well, the strong tonight clearly was Lindale as they win it and win it big. But don't worry, Coach Garvin will put some teeth back in those Tigers before too long. For producer Patrick Madrowski and photographer Jeff Irwin, I'm Neil Beasley with your DQ Big Game of the Week.